Hi Pisces, welcome to Magpie Moonshine. My name is Kaylee. This is your next weekly tarot reading. This is for the 21st to the 26th. Can you believe we're already nearly done with February? That's crazy. That's crazy. I don't know where it's gone. Anyway, let's see what we got for you for this week. All the normal housekeeping stuff is down below as always. Let's kick it and see what happens. Okay, you have the five of wands, so you're coming up against competition and competitiveness. People may be abrasive this week towards you, Pisces. Um, very aware of COVID battles going on. Maybe you're coming up against obstacles trying to get your vaccine this week when you should be entitled to it, possibly. Um... But yeah, there are obstacles coming up this week. I'm not going to pretend, Pisces. It's going to need a, fat, a fight and a battle to get over them. Um, let's see what else we've got. Wheel of Fortune. Twist of Fate coming in, though. Let's see what we've got. What else have we got? A Twist of Fate means if... It's normally a twist in the upward direction. So if you are in this energy at the moment where you feel like everything's a struggle, everything's a battle... There's just obstacles in the way. This really would short, would indicate that um, things are about to turn up in your favour. Let's see, what else have we got? A positive change, basically. The wheel turns up when that comes up in that direction, generally. Okay, anything else with Pisces this week? The Emperor. Um, this can be an Aries. This is somebody that very much takes command of um, their environment, their resources, and they make things happen and expand their horizons. Um, so yeah, you could be looking at taking over somewhere um, or literally looking to move possibly. Have you been struggling with trying to move this week, Pisces? Um, whatever it is, you're gonna, you are very much taking command and being in the driving seat. Um, this week to make things happen i'm guessing that this upward turn this upward twist of the wheel is um going to very much provide you with the um fire up your ass to get moving and make something happen and i kind of really like that energy i really like that energy it's very airy it's very make things happen very i want it it's gonna but it's almost like that gives you the encouragement and you seem to have the resources you need to make that happen. This is the King of Pentacles. This is somebody that has financial um, abundance, basically. Financial well, financial, and also material abundance. He has a kingdom. And he can provide for a kingdom. So, um, yeah. And again, Taurus. So if this is something that you've struggled to get off the ground, maybe this week you're going to find some upturn that's very much going to bring in abundance and progress in the next coming months because this is Aries into Taurus. So, um, yeah, whatever it is you're battling to get off the ground, keep going because it's about to turn up in your favour. I really like that. Clear decisions to be made. You have clear insight. Do not make emotional decisions. Make sure you research fully and you're very clear. Be mindful of, of emotions, but don't use them as a, um, what's, what am I looking for? What's the word I'm looking for? As the grounds to make that decision. Um, and then you have six of pentacles. Don't be afraid to ask for help if you need it going forward. And also, if you do find you're in this position of excess, don't be afraid to bestow, um, to share the wealth a little bit. To share the wealth. Or you'll be in a position where you can share the wealth a little bit. But yeah, only you can decide how best to apply that abundance that comes in. That was really quick for Pisces. I will give you a oracle card. Wisdom of the oracle card. Poised. Yeah, you are poised on the edge of something amazing right now. I really like this energy, Pisces. I really like the whole get up and go and greatness is just about just around the corner. But it, it changes this week. It changes this week by the look of it. I really like this energy, Pisces. You have to let me know if it resonates because it's amazing. Um, your self-care card, oh, as if you couldn't have done with a better card for your thing, is abundance planning. Plan how you're going to make this happen. Very much in this emperor 
energy deciding how and and the king of pentacles he's a strategist as well plans for abundance how he's going to expand his kingdom make sure the fields attended to so very much um following a uh, delving into abundance planning this week pisces i really really love i know that's short and sweet pisces but great things are on their way to you you're planning and doing the work and it's paying off I know there's these obstacles, but they, they're they just obstacles. They're not roadblocks. They're obstacles. You just need to get over them um, or around them or keep fighting the fight until you get to where you need to be. It's just, literally the upturn is on its way. Um, I hope that's been of some help for you, Pisces. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.